Hi guys, Jill Colleen here for the Rabbit Hole Designs. Today I'm going to show you Taste Like Summer. So let's get started. Let me show you how I assembled my card. I started with my card base and we added this purple layer and I did that with tape runner. And it was centered right like that. And then we added our purple plaid layer also with tape runner. Then I added my green layer and I did that with fun foam and double-sided adhesive, the quarter inch. And I centered that. Next we have our little um, stripe layer and I put that on with tape runner. The green gives it a nice little border like the purple did for the plaid. Then I added my little purple layer also with fun foam and double sided adhesive. And that got centered also. And then I have my image that I colored and you'll see I added some silver um, thread to the back of it and some foam squares and that's how I'm going to mount it with the foam squares. Then I stamped my sentiment in VersaFine um, and heat embossed it with uh, clear powder. You wanna make sure um, when you are heat embossing, you <laughs> want to use your cottontail tool. Awesome tool. If you don't have one, check it out. They are fabulous. You're gonna love it. So I added my sentiment with a little bit of tape runner. I just did it right in the center because I um, put it a little offset or crooked and I put it right there on the cone and there you have tastes like summer Thanks. I like to embellish the flap of my envelope so actually this stamp set comes with a really cool um, stencil set and it's called scooped three layers um, it has the tops and then it has the cones and then it has the full image together or the full cutout together. So I thought it'd be really cool to do the whole back of the envelope, including the, um, the back, you know, the flap and the back. So I'm going to go ahead and do the tops first and I'm using my brand new, 
um, rabbit hole brushes. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, they are so smooth and soft. They really make blending easy. And the color I'm using for this is Wilted Violet. It's a Tim Holtz um, Distressed Oxide. And it really goes on super smooth. Give you some nice, nice purple ice cream. And there we have the tops of our cones. And then I'm going to go ahead and lay down the cones. Tape keeps sticking. Okay, and I'm going to do the um, the cone parts in vintage photo. I really like these brushes. This is the first time I'm using them. They really hold in your hand nice too. They're very ergonomic. And there are the whole back of my envelope. That's the front. It has ice cream cones. How cool is that?